Hello, hello, it's CEO here. And today, I will show you how to win the bug off. The bug off event is centered around the NPC, Flick, and his bug catching contest. The goal of the bug off is to catch as many bugs as possible in three minutes. This event is only held during the summer months in your island's hemisphere. Every third Saturday during the summer months, Isabel will announce that the bug off is today. Also real quick, before I get further into the video, just a reminder to please leave a like on this video and subscribe if you aren't already. Liking and subscribing really helps the channel out and it lets me continue making these videos for you. Knowing this, we already know the bug off event dates for the rest of the year. In the Northern Hemisphere, the bug off occurs on June 27th, July 25th, August 22nd, and September 26th. And in the Southern Hemisphere, the bug off occurs on November 21st, December 19th, January 16th, and February 20th. This event only lasts from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m., so you'll want to keep an eye out for the time. But you can always time travel to the correct time if you miss it or you're busy during the day. To start the event, you have to talk to Flick in the plaza. The initial fee to play is free, then costs 500 bells for every other attempt. You can do as many attempts as you'd like until the event is over for the day. The rules of the bug off are simple. You get one point for each bug you catch, with an additional two bonus points if you catch three or more bugs within the three minutes. Your point total will accumulate over the course of the event and you can exchange them for exclusive bug off prizes. These prizes include the termite mound, toy cockroach, spider web, toy centipede, butterfly's wall, ladybug rug, spider door plate, artisanal bug cage, which also doubles as a wardrobe, bug wand, bug aloha shirt, bug cage, which is a wearable item for your villager, butterfly backpack, another very cute wearable item, and the ladybug umbrella. If your goal is to get one of each prize, you will need to earn a total of 130 points. You can exchange 10 points to get a random prize from Flick, and you won't get duplicates of each prize until you receive one of each first. If your goal is to earn the bug off trophies, you will need 100 points for bronze, 200 points for silver, and 300 points for gold. If those numbers seem steep to you, you can always play this event with friends. By using Animal Crossing multiplayer, you can invite others to your island while the bug off is happening and catch bugs together. You will rack up points faster as all the points earned by everyone get added to your personal point pool. The 500 bell entry fee is also waived every time when you play the bug off in multiplayer mode. You also don't have to worry about the bugs you catch clogging up your pocket space as they magically spawn into Flick's bug cage in the plaza. This way, you can stock up on nets in your pockets if you don't feel like running back to your house storage or crafting a net between rounds. When each round is over, you can either sell the bugs you've caught to Flick for 1.5 times their typical selling price or remove them yourself from the cage. But if you don't remove or sell them, you won't be able to play the next round. This applies to your friends as well if they are playing the event with you on your island. Now this wouldn't be a CEO video if I didn't give you some pro tips on how to conquer this event. First, and a little obvious, is that you want to catch every bug you see. You never want to pass up on a bug you can easily catch. Second, plant some flowers near the plaza. Bugs love to spawn on flowers, and having some close to the plaza will save you time that you would otherwise use running around your island looking for flowers. Third, plant trees and cut stumps near your plaza. We often forget that bugs spawn on these plants as well. Having additional trees and stumps on your island allows for more bug spawning opportunities. Fourth, try not to run during the event. Running scares away bugs, which means losing out on points. Fifth, bugs can also spawn in the water. Don't forget to check rivers and ponds as bugs can be found there too. And lastly, leave some trash out on the ground, like the can, rotten turnips, or even a lollipop from the Halloween event, as these items also attract bugs and are very easy to catch. Just remember to pick them up after the event is over. To help you even more, these bugs are likely to spawn on flowers and trees. The drone beetle, goliath beetle, honeybee, ladybug, mantis, orchid mantis, and the stink bug. And these bugs are likely to spawn on tree stumps and on the ground. The citrus longhorned beetle, the drone beetle, jewel beetle, Rosalia batisi beetle, tiger beetle, and violin beetle. And of course, butterflies can be found flying around your island, especially near flowers. Unlike for the fishing tourney, where you can use fish bait to spawn fish on the spot, there is no fish bait equivalent for catching bugs. So your best bet to spawn more bugs is to have lots of flowers, trees, and stumps around your island. If your island is lacking any of these plants, 
You can always bury a piece of fruit and let it grow into a tree, and buy flowers from Nook's Cranny, plant them, and let them fully grow. If for some reason the bug off is not happening on the day it should be on your island, you must have resident services upgraded from a tent to a building in order to trigger the event. If that is not possible for you to do, you can always visit a friend who has the event active. And thanks to time traveling, you can play the bug off event whenever you like. You simply need to time travel to one of the dates during the summer and the bug off will be active for you to play. You can also use time traveling to play the event longer on the specific bug off days if you want more time to catch bugs and rack up points. You just have to be careful to not time travel too far or two back in time, or you will lose your total points for that day. If you stay between 9 a.m. and 6 p.m. on your current day, you will not lose any points. I hope this video helps you get the most out of the Bug Off event. Let me know in the comments if you will be playing the Bug Off this Saturday. If you like this video, please leave a like as it really helps the channel out, and consider subscribing if you aren't already, and I'll see you in the next video.